Hello, my name is Ambrose. I got this Australian Botany Bay cockroach here. And the reason I found it crawling around is because it's diurnal. I know, it's pretty strange for a cockroach to be diurnal. Let's take a look at it. The Botany Bay cockroach actively forages for food during the day. It feeds on pollen, bark, and leaf material. <laughs> it's on the camera. <laughs> it's on the camera. Tickle so much. That's it making all those squeaking noises. The Botany Bay cockroach likes to bask in the sun on rocks, leaf litter, or even on low vegetation, or generally just where it's sunny. He rarely hides. The Botany Bay cockroach can release a foul-smelling odour to deter predators, but it hasn't done it to me yet. They mate by joining the tips of their abdomen together. Look at him bask in the sun. The female produces an oophica on the ends of her abdomen. The oophica is an egg case which she carries around before depositing it on a piece of wood or substrate. After 45 to 65 days after the female laid it, the little baby cockroaches, little nymphs, will hatch out of the egg and they'll go the separate ways to hopefully become as big and as strong as she was and not get picked off by predators. And the nymphs are small versions of adults. They'll reach maturity after nine months. They live for 12 to 18 months. You can tell the difference from the females and the males by looking on their underside. And the female, the last segment, has a split down the middle. But the last segment on the male's underside is whole. So what do you think this one is? This one is a female. What's cool about the Botany Bay cockroach is that it can make a hissing noise for defence. They make this noise by forcing air out of the small breathing holes on their sides. I can see the breathing pores between this leg and that leg. Those yellow dots, like right between those two legs. That's it. Spiracles there on that f that flap. Can you see it? Spiracles. So. I better say goodbye, so bye, cockroach. Thanks for watching and bye for now. I'll see you on our next adventure. Subscribe so you can join me on our next adventure.